But if you take a look at the operation, take a look at the managed payments and checks, this check has been voided, but this check has been regenerated. For the voided and paid, you won't be able to delete any check. Let's give it a shot. If I say, go ahead and delete 4002 to 4002, it wouldn't let me because you have to make sure that the status is only set as created, not to be paid or voided. You notice how to void a check, how to regenerate the check, etc. So the status is sent. Can we generate the check for bridge accounts? So let's go ahead and do that. I go to check bridging, I click OK. I go to the documents and I set this to be a screen again. I click OK and I click OK. It's going to generate a brand new check for all the checks that are supposed to be posted towards bridging account. Let's go ahead and save that and view it. You notice that this is basically showing me there is a first installment, second installment, and the third installment. For my demonstration's sake, even though I had a chance to pay over time, I'm not going to. I'm just going to take care of it right now. The value, they're all gone towards the bridging account. And now let's say we're going to post this. So by the time I post it to begin with, certain things are going to be different. The reason you will see the value of the trial balance changes immediately because we change everything to be synchronous or asynchronous. When I calculate the balances, the value indeed has changed to 60,000 and some change for domestic vendor account because the vendor invoices have been literally paid off. And as a matter of fact, if I refresh the open vendor invoices, those invoices that have been settled are gone. The only two invoices that are remaining indeed are those two invoices that you have not paid for. So these are open vendor invoices. That means you have not taken care of it. You have to pay them. I keep it as it is for future demonstration, but at this moment, you have already took care of the payments, so therefore everything has been indeed balanced properly and you can see exactly what is going on. For domestic account, you have nothing left. You have paid entirely. By going through this demonstration, you have seen the daily procedures within accounts payable, distribution of accounts, charges for the header, for the line, and that concludes the accounts payable daily procedures.